Hi YouTube, this is We All Juggle Knives and Lights with the Through Knight TN40. Alright, now the maximum lumens on this, 4,450. That is a lot of lumens, but when would you purchase this instead of, uh, for example, this Nywalker light, right, which is uh, 6,800 lumens. Or even this uh, through night, uh, it's a TN36UT, which is over 7,000 lumens. Well, I'll tell you, lumens are important, but they're not everything, right? Because range also plays a role. I can tell you that this TN40 far, far outranges these two lights. You see there the emitter configuration. It's a cluster configuration you have four emitters. Now normally when you have a cluster like that it means it's a floodlight but this is an exception to that rule and when you see that head assembly from the side you know it's it's no secret how they get that range okay a massive reflector but first the basic operation of this light it's all controlled by this side switch it's got five brightness levels moonlight then low, medium, high, and then turbo. All right, to get to moonlight, you just long press this from the off position. So let me do that. And that is the moonlight. It's a super low mode that's just used for reading usually. Now to get to the regular brightness levels, you just press this, turn the light on, and you just keep it pressed down, and you can cycle through low, medium, and high. Let's do that right now. Right, low, medium, and high. Now this has a memory function, right? So it'll come back in whichever of those modes it was turned off in. All right, you see that. Now how do you get to the turbo mode? You double tap this, right, when it's on, double tap, and it goes straight to turbo. Okay, that is that 4,450, and it is super super bright in the turbo mode. Now another double tap will give you strobe. Okay, strobe warning. And there is your strobe. Now as far as the power system of the light, it comes with an integrated battery pack. Okay, that's a battery pack. So you don't need to buy right, extra batteries to put in here. Now that battery pack has a uh, 6,800 milliamp hours of capacity. And this is what this all looks like, and this just screws in like so. All right now, this has a battery charge indicator. You see that switch there? If you press that, you see how it glows blue? That indicates that this is um, pretty much fully charged. Now, in order to recharge that, it comes with this uh, plug and cable. And in order to recharge that, you just plug that in to any normal electric outlet and plug this end into the light here, right? And you see that color there, it's a charging indicator. And there's also a charging indicator here. You see it's green because this is nearly fully charged because I had just recharged it. So how do I feel about that setup? I like the integrated battery pack because you're not going to be uh, juggling batteries from one light to another. You know, the batteries are always with the light. With that indicator, it's really easy to tell if you need to recharge them. So you can basically have this thing always topped off and the batteries are always with it. Okay, at this time, let's roll in some footage of testing and demonstrating this out at night. I went to a couple sports fields to... Uh, demonstrate the range. I hope you enjoy the footage and then we'll be back with final conclusions about this light. We got a full moon tonight. All the lunatics are out and the werewolves. All right, we're going to be going on little adventures, just testing out and demoing this flashlight. But I just wanted to show you that out here with the through night TN40 on the testing board, going to cycle through the modes. Right, and now the turbo mode with a double tap. 
Wow. That is the turbo mode, and it's just... That's whiteout city. That is very impressive. Okay, strobe warning. And back to that turbo. And here I am by the roadside. I'm gonna pan around this grove of trees just to give you something to look at. There's a little bit of humidity in the air, a little bit of moisture. And here I am in the middle of the night at Frog Creek, at least that's what I call it, with this through night. This is the highest mode. All right, and you can hear that water flowing. Let me shine this down the creek, that little log bridge. There's a lot of frogs around here. I don't know if you can hear them. Well, let's zoom in and see how well this can uh, light up the water. Wow, this is bright down there. I mean, it's like you could drink that through the screen. You can see each tiny little bubble. And I'm up on the, uh, you know, the banks of the creek here. I'm up here. All right, very cool. Did you hear that frog? And here it is just shining all the way down the road. That's a long, lonely road, and there ain't no lights on this road. No lights, no houses, just frogs. I'm out here at a soccer field with this through night. There's the first goal. And this even reaches to the goal across from it. And I'm just way back. Look how far I am. I mean, check out the range. All right, you see the first goal and the second goal. I am way back here. Here I am at another sports field. All right, you see that goal? We're at one goal. And I believe that's 100 meters down. Somebody told me they play rugby at this field. But they don't do that during the summertime, so it's kind of abandoned. All right, so this is the far goal I zoomed in. And you can see there's a lot of moisture in the air, but this is uh, cutting through it. Yeah, I mean, this is lighting it up really well. Let me zoom back. From goal to goal. You know, it's really important to have goals in life. Oh, that was a bad joke. Very bad joke. All right, we are back. I hope you enjoyed that demo. Now, what are my final conclusions about the light? You know, this has a lot of range. I mean, it easily, easily will go across an entire soccer field, the rugby field, the football field. If you got a field, this thing will cross it. And actually, the stats are 10 times the distance, right? It's uh, more than a thousand meters maximum range. I mean, that is impressive. Now, what's the useful range? Dude, it's, it's got to be several soccer fields in length. As far as the interface, that's very intuitive. You know, long press, shortcut to the moonlight, double tap, shortcut to the turbo. I mean, it's, it's very easy to figure out, especially if you've had other through night uh, lights before. The power system, we already discussed the benefits of having that integrated battery pack. That's very cool. And, you know, I think one reason they did that is because they didn't want people using crappy batteries in such a good light because, you know, crappy batteries, they can be dangerous. And also, the light's just not going to perform like it can if you don't feed it the right batteries. So I think to avoid you know, some of those amateur mistakes, they just give you a battery pack meant for it. It's a good idea. So basically, this light has the range and it has the lumens. More than 4,000 lumens, legitimately. This is the most impressive new model that I've seen from this company in the last year. Alright, so hope you enjoyed seeing it. This has been We All Juggle Knives and Lights. I'm out.